welcome to another episode of Metal Ween. And today I'm going to be counting down my top 10 white zombie songs. Uh, I think I believe the uh, other day I had done top 10 Rob Zombie songs, and I, I got a few requests for white zombie songs. So now I'm just going to be doing it. And this is going to be a, a quick video. I'm not sure exactly how long it will be, but. Uh, it's not going to be like a super long video, but uh, yeah. Alright, let's get things started. At number 10, Murder World from Make Them Die Slowly. Uh, this is probably like the standout track on uh, Make Them Die Slowly, which was White Zombie's second official album. And uh, this is a really cool one. And Murder World uh, is going to be uh, the name of the uh, place in which 31 Rob Zombie's new movie takes place. So I thought that was pretty interesting. And uh, Make Them Die Slow is a more heavier, it's a heavier album than um, Soul Crusher. It kind of leans more towards that standard heavy metal style. Number 9, Drown in the Colossus from Soul Crusher. Soul Crusher is a pretty, a bit of an underrated album. Uh, it's basically noise rock, but it's still pretty cool. And uh, this one is uh, very interesting to listen to. Um, just uh, pretty, pretty cool. Number 8, I Am Legend from La Sexo Sisto. Uh, La Sexo Sisto is my favorite out, one of my favorite albums of all time. So uh, this definitely had to make the list. And I really love the intro to this. I really love just the clean guitar intro to this one. It's really cool and it, it really does set up the atmosphere uh, very well. You know, the rest of the song is kind of your typical groove metal uh, kind of song, but, um, just a really cool song to, uh, and with a great, great intro. If you haven't heard it, definitely check it out. It is pretty amazing. Number seven, Black Sunshine from Lost Six of Sisto. Of course, uh, a great, great song from, uh, Lost Six of Sisto. And, uh, Black Sunshine is pretty awesome. It also has Iggy Pop on, uh, kind of narrating the song at the beginning and at the end. So that's, that's pretty cool. And the music video is also pretty interesting as well. Number su number six, welcome to Planet Mother <laughs> slash Psychoholic Slag from Lost Six of Sisto. Uh, this one is a great intro song on Lost Six of Sisto. I'm I'm choosing a lot of songs from Lost Six of Sisto. That's my favorite rock, favorite white zombie album, of course. But uh, yeah, and um. This is a really great intro. It does kind of take a while to get started, but uh, it's pretty cool. And um, it's kind of like two songs in one, you know. Kind of like two parts with Suck Hog Swag being the second part. And I think I actually like that part more because it's a bit slowed down some. It's a bit uh, kind of groove metal. And it's just uh, really cool to listen to. Number five, Real Solution number nine. From Astro Creep 2000. Uh, finally a track from uh, Astro Creep. Uh, just a really, really cool song from that one. And I think it, at the very beginning it has like a Manson Family sample. So that's pretty interesting to listen to. And uh, just a really cool... And Rob Zombie's vocals on here are really cool. As I said the other day, he's always had vocal uh, vocal effects on his vocals on his albums. I think it's it's a really cool effect. I have no idea what he's saying at all, but uh, it's just really, really cool. And it's, he also uses the uh, tagline for from um, from Texas Chainsaw Massacre, who will survive and what will be left of them. So that's a pretty cool shout-out to Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Number four, Rat Mouth from Soul Crusher. Uh, Soul Crusher, as I've said, is a bit of an underrated album. And this one, I believe, is the opening track to it. And it's just uh, really cool. It's very noisy. But if you can get past that, it's pretty cool to listen to. Number three, More Human Than Human from Astro Creep 2000. Of course, this is a song that a lot of people, a lot of fans know, you know. And uh, just really, really, really good, you know what I mean? And it's just... Uh, it's pretty good, and the music video is awesome as well, you know. And I pretty much love the, um, I'm not sure what you would call it, 
uh, the flicker effect or, or something like that. Strobe light effect. I, I guess it's a strobe light. I really don't know. But it's just a really cool effect that the music video has. And the music video is awesome as well. Probably the best white zombie music video. Number two. Disaster Blaster 2 from God of Thunder. And God of Thunder was a very brief EP that they did back in 89. And this kind of hints at the Lost Exorcist of Sound. Because it has a heavier sound than their first two albums. And, uh, you know, it kind of hints at that Lost Exorcist of Groove Metal sound. And this one is a reworking of Disaster Blaster from Make Them Die Slowly. And I like this one far better. It's much more heavier. And it's just all around better. And finally, number one, my all-time favorite white zombie song. Thunder Kiss 65 from Lost Sexual Sisto. Uh, it doesn't really take a brain surgeon to figure out exactly why I love this song. It was featured in Bride of Chucky, Am I Right or Am I Right? But yeah, uh, just this song is just pretty good. You know, just like a, a classic 90s heavy metal song. I think a lot of people... You know, kind of forget how awesome the 90s was for heavy metal music. While there was kind of grunge here and there, uh, it still had some pretty good heavy metal songs. This one notwithstanding. This one is really, really good. It's really awesome. And you know, White Tommy was kind of keeping heavy metal alive in the 90s or so, along with Pantera and other bands. You know, so this is a really cool song. Very groovy kind of song, you know. And the music video is pretty trippy as well. It's awesome. So that's all for my top 10 white zombie songs. It's a bit of a short video, but whatever. And I'll be back with some more Metal Ween.